Well, breaking news for you now in the 15-year-old Russian figure skater who was allowed to stay and compete at the Winter Olympics despite a failed drugs test last year has missed out on a medal in the individual final coming fourth after making a number of errors in her routine. Well, our sports correspondent Tom Parminter joins me now. So, Tom, did the pressure get to her then in the end? Well, the talk in Beijing before this figure skating final was that you either get 100% at Camilla Valieva and she's just flawless, or you get something drastically wrong. And, and really, that is what we saw. She fell several times during her final routine. She was expected to be amongst the medals, but those falls cost her and she finished fourth in the end in the individual competition. So after all of the discussion around her continuing to participate in the Winter Olympics, given the fact that we know that she tested positive for a banned substance in December of last year, uh, all of that controversy and all of that pressure, I think, showed and it cracked the final performance and it was a mess. And she swiped the air with her hand as she finished the performance. There were tears and she blew that big opportunity. Such expectation on her. She is one of the most talented skaters on the planet, but it all went so badly wrong in Beijing in that final appearance that she was making this lunchtime. And it is a cruel end. And it's really a position that a 15 year old should never really have been put into. And the authorities and the games organizers will have a lot of questions to, to face around it. But the flip side of it is that three other skaters, uh, another two Russians and one of the Japanese skaters make it into the top three. Uh, there is a Russian at the, in the gold medal position. Uh, and those skaters will get justice because they will get their medal ceremony that they wouldn't have had if Valieva had been in the top three. So one of the most dramatic Olympic finals in recent memory. And Valieva crashes out of that final, finishes fourth in the competition and leaves these Winter Games to try to pick her way through a drugs inquiry, a doping inquiry that she is still at the centre of. She did win a gold with her team in the uh, team competition uh, earlier in these games, which is still very much pending. They, those medals haven't been presented yet, but all of the eyes of the sporting world were on Valieva in this final today, the individual competition, and it crumbled around her. Very, very upsetting. And I think while, of course, you have a 15-year-old at the heart of this, and there is something of a tragedy around that, there is also the fact that those skaters who have worked so hard, who have got onto the podium, will actually get their moments with their medals in Beijing after this competition.